How are you all doing? It's Cam back at you again. Today I bring you a new axe, an unexpected buy, uh, which isn't mine. Uh, it is for my dad's. He bought it out of nowhere, and I thought I'd bring it on here. It's obviously a Charvel Sandimas 2016 in rocket red, as opposed to pink, uh, which I also own. It is a gorgeous guitar. Everybody knows the specs of these. Charvel tuners, uh, flat saw maple neck. Uh, Floyd Rose, uh, obviously locking up for the original Floyd Rose Tram, made in Korea, uh, the FLT-1000 as opposed to the 2000 on the SoCals, Seymour Duncan, JB in 59, older body, and the pickups are screwed uh, directly into the body, uh, excluding the need for bezels and things. There's also a truss rod adjustment, uh, thumb wheel, at the, um, at the bottom of the neck here. And it's just an all-round awesome guitar, and it's just as zingy and gorgeous as neon pink. But what's interesting with this one, this was acquired for an absolute bargain. Uh, I'm not going to say how much it was or where it came from, but it was a very, very, very gorgeous... Uh, gorgeous? It is, it is gorgeous, but it was a serious bargain. And what's interesting with this guitar, and I'll show you a test of this in a minute, uh, is the previous owner of this guitar stripped out the, um, the six-pack of sound feature which uh, all the 2000, uh, 2016 Charvels came with. If you don't know the six pack of sound, it's basically where you could, you obviously have the addition of a tone knob, of course, and also the, uh, the push-pull pot, which you can just uh, pull out and then you've got a bunch of single coil tones. And this guy has completely and utterly stripped out all of the six pack of sound wiring and uh, basically kept it, well, it's just kept it as a standard um, Charvel. There's no uh, single coil positions. Anyway, I'm rambling, but I'm going to A B the sound of this guitar with my trusty uh, pink Sandimus. So I'll just show you how that actually made a huge difference. It's not actually any better or any worse, it's just very different, and I'll show you what I mean. But anyway, uh, let's take a little look through uh, this guitar and how it sounds.
let's check out this guitar on my favourite sound, which is my overdrive sound, my main overdrive that is. <laughs> No dog on bad, but anyway. <laughs> I did actually say I was going to AB this guitar with my pink Sandemus because obviously this guitar has had the six pack of sound stripped out of it. Basically, it's, I assume it's all new electronics. I'm not actually taking a look inside and I probably never will. But the electronics are pretty much gone. The uh, D, uh, I don't know what you call it, the D10 uh, tone pot or whatever, where you turn it all the way up to 10 and it turns off, does not function anymore. It does not have that feature. It's just a regular tone knob and regular volume knob. And it's amazing uh, what the difference in sound is, actually. Um, so I'll, I'll play you a riff, and then I'll swap to the other guitar. The settings on the amp are, are preset. It's exactly the same, so I don't need to change it. And literally, it's quite amazing how different the sound is. There's no better or no worse. It's just different. See what you think. And in fact, I'll probably start with the pink one first. So just give me a moment. Okay, this guitar has got the six pack of sound in, and just hear what it sounds like, say, with this riff. <laughs> Right, just absorb that for a moment. My ears through here. I don't know how well it comes across through the camera, but the uh, the sound with the six pack of sound stripped out is um, actually a bit beefier. Although the other one's a little bit more top end friendly, so it's better for everything else. It's a bit more balanced out. But the um, but it's just amazing what the difference is. It's no better, no worse in my opinion, and I can still make it work. But it's great for me. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Everybody needs a Charvel. Uh, you have to get one of these. They're absolutely amazing. They, they would suit all of your sonic needs and they just look amazing. I mean, literally, if you were doing a, a gig, you just need one of these so people can see you nowadays. They're just gorgeous. And uh, you certainly do make a statement if you own one. Uh, nevertheless, I hope you like this video. Please like and subscribe. Uh, and I'll see you very soon. Take care. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.